Hello everybody, my name is Moritz and today I want to show you this very nice lang spantechnik zero point system. So this is a yeah, zero point system, um, one of the original systems. Um, I'm not sure if they invented this particular kind, but they were at least um, one of the first to get to market with it. So how does it work? You have these uh, studs, four of them, and you screw them into a pallet, into an aluminum pallet or into a vise, and then these go into the holes, and then you can actuate the system here with this bolt uh, with an eight um, hex key, and then the screws or these bolts get pushed down and are very solid. And they say it repeats um, within five microns, so you can also have multiple pellets and get a very nice repeatability. So the quality of the studs is pretty good. They have a turn finish and are hardened. And the way they function, they have a threaded hole on top and then you just screw in these uh, threaded rods and then screw the whole stud into your pallet or into your vise. And as you can see, they're also very nicely packaged. And then, as you can see here, they are the four um, holes where the studs go into. They are very nicely chamfered. And as you can see, if I screw in the actuating screw, you can see that, uh, maybe a little bit. Yeah, now you can see them, the bolts move in and push the studs down. So in general it is very nicely made. It is flat and parallel within uh, three to four microns. I've measured that on my granite plate and the quality itself is very nice. It has drain holes. So as you can see here in every one of the four holes um, it goes through and so it can drain coolant. Also locating features and these four mounting holes. And it also comes with these plugs you can put in there so there can't go any chips into your screw holes. Also, these little um, plastic studs in here, they push these studs down so you can, no, no it's locked, but you can then remove it a little bit uh, with a little bit less effort. And as you can see, very interesting, um, here these are stamping marks and these come from production. So they have a clamping system uh, which interfaces with their vices. And as you can see, they use their own vices or their own system in the production of these zero point plates. The outside is milled, but with a nice finish. And of course, laser marked. Yes, so here uh, on the side, there are six, six through holes. They go all the way through. And this is where they um, put in the actuating pins or the actuating bolts. Uh, but I will show that later when I disassemble the, the plate. So all in all, I really like it, uh, very high quality, um, not only the plate, but also the, the bolts are very nicely made, very, very close tolerance. So all four were within, uh, I think, one or two microns uh, in diameter. So the functioning diameter is this one here. And on this uh, uh, 45 degree, it gets uh, pulled down. It is expensive, um, but in my opinion, well worth the price. And I'm very um, looking forward to see how it can improve my, my work holding. Okay, now let's take a look inside and see how it functions. Okay, so now I have uh, disassembled 
the zero point system, the line plate, and these are the inner workings. So I laid it on top, and as you can see, um, this in the front is the screw that actuates the system. So it consists of uh, these bolts, and um, if you turn this screw here, you push against this bolt here, and as you can see, it has a nice big chamfer. And this wedges these two bolts outside, and then these push against um, these two bolts. They are separated and are connected with a spring. So um, they get wedged outside, and then they interface with these studs like this, push them down and press them outwards. And because they are connected with a spring, if you release the pressure from, from the screw here, they push together again, so you can easily remove the pallet. So pretty simple system. And these are just um, pushed into the through holes here in the pallet. As you can see, there are um, these through holes, they are um, blocked with this plastic studs and also from the side. And these just go in there and you can push them in the middle where they sit and then function. So pretty clever system, pretty yeah, simple system and also very reliable. So that's it for this presentation. I hope you liked it. Thanks and bye bye.